Now, the war rages on in Ukraine. The Ukrainian capital, Kiev, along with seven other regions of the country, reportedly have experienced some massive blackouts. Ukraine's state electricity has announced that the blackouts have in fact happened in the aftermath of the missile strikes by Russia. Now remember, in recent weeks, the attacks on power grid and water infrastructure in and near Kiev have in fact intensified. Це не війна, це тероризм, це геноцид. Путіну ми, українці, не потрібні. Йому потрібна територія, йому потрібна Україна, без нас. І тому все, що, він, що, все, що зараз відбувається, це геноцид. І йому, його завдання, щоб ми померли, замерзли, чи взялись і кудись поїхали, і залишили йому нашу землю. От таке завдання агресора. But the mayor has in fact urged Kiev's residents, in the worst scenario of a total blackout, they should consider moving to emergency accommodation with friends and family who live outside of Kiev, with access to autonomous water and heating supplies. Now, Kiev, remember, has been battling blackouts and has blamed Russia. Kherson, interestingly, is also without power and water, and the Russian installed authorities there have blamed Ukrainian forces for shelling on their power and water resources. Now, amidst the blame game, the truth, of course, remain, remains hidden in the fog of war. But what is very clear is that it is the civilians who are suffering in this bruising war that's in fact been unleashed on Ukraine by Russia. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.